with Mark Schaefer. Hello, Mr. Schaefer. So, Mark, thank you for meeting with me today. Now, you've written many books, you've written many blogs, you've <laughs> spoken all around the world, mm -hmm. teaching, mentoring small business and big businesses on the importance of content marketing and content creations. How important is it for business today to have a, a, a content and social, social media strategy? Well, uh, content is really the fuel for social media. And um, a lot of people don't really understand that. That um, today, it's for most businesses, it's really essential to have some sort of social media presence because that's where people are spending most of their time today. That's where a lot of discovery is taking place in terms of finding businesses and services. And I think uh, you have to have some sort of content strategy because that is the catalyst that drives awareness. It drives connection and that leads to trust and hopefully that will lead to engagement of some sort. So they really kind of go together. If you're, um, I think if you're doing social media well, then you're really doing content marketing because you have to have some sort of great content um, at the center to drive your social media strategy. For someone that's just, uh, that, that is, has no presence or just starting out, when we're talking about content creation, what type mm. of content is, uh, would be a good way, place to start? Well, not all content is created equal. And I think that <clears throat> to really have the opportunity for uh, your, your best chance of success and the best opportunity for massive reach and awareness, you need to have something that I call rich content. So that would be either a blog post, a podcast, or a video series. And some businesses that are visually oriented, something like pho photography on Instagram or Pinterest uh, might also be an option. But generally speaking, you need to have something more than a tweet, something more than a Facebook post to give your customers value, to make them keep coming back to establish your voice of authority. You need to have content that's a little bit deeper, a little bit richer. And for most businesses, probably the most accessible form is blogging. Um, because a lot of people, a lot of businesses already have content today, some sort of written content, sales materials, marketing materials, press releases, uh, website copy that you can start turning into uh, blog posts over time. So that's what where most businesses go first. But my, my view would be don't be overwhelmed with it. Um, just try something and, and get started. I love what you call it in Twitter of um, the tail of Twitter, mm -hmm. authentic helpfulness. Yes. How important that is to come from a place of giving when you're generating content. But it's, it's we need to have a new mindset because whenever we're doing uh, uh, advertising, uh, we're in this kind of mentality of. Uh, of, of broadcasting. We've been conditioned to broadcast and advertise for uh, really a century now. And uh, on social media, people are there to get away from that. Um, they don't, they're tired of being advertised to, they're tired of being marketed to, but they will go to people and companies and brands who uh, will help them help them make money, help them save money, help them have a happier life, a healthier life, a more fun life. So we need to move out of this mindset of sell, sell, sell into help, help, help. And that's hard for businesses to do, but that's really a key to success. Fantastic. Your latest book, The Content Code, Congratulations! It Thank you. is uh, it's uh, becoming well. All your books have, have really become the little bibles for myself personally. <laughs> but for your latest book, tell us a little bit about the content code, yeah. uh, how uh, how it came to be, and um, and what is the the most important message within within the content code. Well, we live in. Uh a very information dense world. I think you can make an argument that this is the hardest time to be in marketing ever because the channels are just so fragmented and so noisy. 
So for the last two years, I've been obsessed with this idea of what do we do? How do we cut through? And so I think I have, you know, an answer. I have an answer to that. And uh, so I wrote this book about the six ways to really ignite your content. I think we're in an era where just producing content really isn't enough. The power, the economic value comes through the sharing, through the ignition. People have to see it, they have to click on it, they have to react to it, they have to engage with it. That's really where the economics of social media and content marketing are. And so once you start digging into the psychology and the science and the art of why do people share content, I found it just really mesmerizing and inspiring in some ways. And that's what the book is about, is understanding how do we ignite content and take our marketing to the next level in a really noisy world. <laughs> I just love that. Now, from a tourism perspective and businesses that are selling experiences, yes. what, is, uh, what, would you, um, what, what are some pieces of, of uh, advice would you say to the small tourism operator that has uh, that is just starting from from scratch. They've only done traditional marketing, and um, yeah, would you have any parting words of wisdom for Mark Schaefer to the small tourism well, business? Well, I think the tourism business is absolutely perfectly poised to succeed in this space. I mean, it, it's not like you're selling weapons or toxic chemicals or something like that. I mean, you're selling happiness, you're selling joy and experiences and family togetherness. I mean, all the statistics say today that people are concerned that they're not spending enough time with their families, that they're you know, too involved with work, that they're working too hard. I mean, so this is an answer. You're providing an answer to a problem that many, many people are, are experiencing right now. And so um, you're not gonna be able to see these people every week or every month or you know, maybe even every year. But through social media and providing you know, interesting, helpful, exciting content, you have the opportunity to provide this drip, drip, drip of communications to connect with people every week and let them know that you're there, there's cool things out there, there's exciting adventures. And uh, I think um, that the, the travel industry in particular is, is well poised to succeed in this space. Oh, fantastic. Mark, thank you so much. All the best. Where can people uh, purchase your the content code? Where are all of your books available? Yeah, uh, you can find all of my books on Amazon, in print, and uh, in electronic versions. And I'm also working on some audio books uh, for, for my books. Some, some people like it that way. And you can find my blog, my podcast, and everything about me at businessesgrow.com. Nobody can spell Schaefer. So uh, it had to be something different. So businessesgrow.com. Lots of great stuff there for, for small and large businesses. Fantastic. Thank you. Can't wait to hear your presentation at Social Media Marketing World here at sunny San Diego. Really, really appreciate your time. Thank well, you, Mark. Thank you.